Hi friends, welcome to Ganesh Charita's YouTube channel. So today in this video, I will explain about EMF equation of a single phase transformer. First, what is mean by a transformer? So transformer is a electrostatic device which transforms the electrical energy from one alternating circuit to another alternating circuit without change in its frequency. Okay. So here we can see a transformer, here we can see primary winding and secondary winding. So in transformer we always give a AC supply only. So primary winding is excited a alternating voltage and it circulates the alternating current. So it produces the alternating flux in primary winding. So this flux is linked with the primary winding. So itself induced an EMF E1. Okay. So in this we can see alternating current is circulates so this alternating circulate uh, current is links with the primary winding so this primary winding uh, this primary winding is induced an emf self induced emf in primary winding is e1 okay so next the flux linked with the uh, secondary winding through a common magnetic core so it produces an emf e2 in secondary winding called mutually induced EMF okay so in secondary winding E2 is a mutually induced EMF so this is the working principle of the transformer so we can see a EMF equation of the single phase transformer so first N1 equal to number of turns in primary winding so this is the number of turns in the primary winding and N2 N2 is the number of turns in the secondary winding so Pi m is the maximum value of the flux. Okay, so f equal to frequency and e1 equal to primary induced emf e1. Here we can see induced emf e1 and here induced emf e2 mutual mutually induced emf is e2. This is self induced emf. So e2 is a secondary induced emf. So from Faraday's law of electromagnetic induction, the average induced EMF in each turn is proportional to the average rate of change in flux. So, this is uh, in Faraday's law of electromagnetic induction, the average value of induced EMF in each turn is the proportional to the average rate of change in flux. So, here we can see d pi by dt equal to change in flux by time required to change in flux. So average EMF of per turn equal to pi, uh, pi m by 1 by 4 f. So pi m means we can see here maximum value of the flux. So average value of uh, average EMF per turn equal to so we can see here this 4 f pi m is get. So for sinusoidal wave form factor equal to we can see RMS value by average value equal to 1.11. So form factor value this is rmf uh, value by average value equal to 1.11 so rms value of induced emf per turn so here uh, average value is uh, is changes to the rhs side so 1.11 into average value so 1.11 into average value is we can see 4 f pi m so 4 f pi m so total ga, so here we can see 4.44 f pi m so in this first one is rms in e1 so in n1 so number of windings in primary winding in primary so rms value of emf induced emf per, uh, primary winding is e1 equal to 4.44 f pi m n1 volts okay so in the this is the primary winding so rms value of induced emf in secondary winding is e2 4.44 f pi m pi m n2 volts so this is the primary and this is secondary so this is the emf equation of the transformer is simple easy okay so if you like this video please, please like share and subscribe the ganesh Tarita's youtube channel thanks for watching